Well, who better to get you ready for your wedding, regardless of how taboo your ideas may be? Dr. Cassidy Hinojosa can make you look and feel your best. She's with Coastal Cosmetic and Plastic Surgery Center right here in the Coastal Bend. And there are some really unique trends that brides are doing these days to help prepare for the wedding, not only for themselves, but for the bridesmaids too, right? Absolutely. Yes, I think brides do a lot of stuff for their bridal parties mm -hmm. now, whether it's all the girls going to get their nails done or hair done yes. or Botox parties. I love that and I've been seeing this a lot. This is trending. It's on social media. You can do a Botox party for any occasion. Maybe you and the girls just, you know, it's hard to get a mommy's night out so right. you have the doctor come to you. But tell me more about Botox parties and what other things we can add to that experience. Yes, so we do Botox parties in our office. We host them either after hours or mm -hmm. on a Saturday and it's a great time for you to come with your girlfriends yes. and just kind of hang out but yeah. also get your Botox done too. Uh -huh. uh, we try to make it really fun and lighthearted, have food, things of that nature. I and I think it. for bridal parties, it's a fun thing to give as a gift for your bridal party yes. if that's what you're wanting to do. Or conversely, if all of your best friends are wanting to do something for the bride. Yeah, and typically it's a way to save money too because when you go in a larger group, you're able to maybe yes. save a few bucks on exactly. those procedures. Now, what other treatments or procedures do you recommend for a bride or anyone preparing to look their best on their wedding day? So I would say, first of all, now's not the time to experiment. Yes. So, you know, I think <laughs> if you are someone that's used to getting Botox or filler and you're wanting to do it before your wedding, that's great. But mm -hmm. I would definitely give yourself about six weeks before. Yes, minimum. Um, you know, with any of those injections, always risk for bruising and swelling. Yep. With Botox, it takes about a week before it starts to work. Mm -hmm. um, and so you want to make sure you've had enough time to kind of have it start working, but all the bruising's gone away before the big day. Absolutely. But again, if you're new to it, I would maybe wait until after the big day mm -hmm. or do it well enough in advance to see if it's something that you like and then maybe get a touch up right before the day of the wedding. Okay, so Botox and fillers for sure. Are there any other treatments or procedures that you found have become really popular for women preparing for the big day? I think anything like all beauty, right? Sure. So facials, Good getting your nails care. done, skincare, yeah. absolutely. I think all that stuff's important just to making you feel your best. You know, you awesome. already look your best, but this is just kind of enhancing that and making you feel good. Very cool. I love that you mentioned this is not the time to experiment because I knew that and I got some kind of like vein removal stuff done to my face right before my bridal portraits, like the day before. And let me just tell you that I look like a swollen pumpkin <laughs> and I had bumps all over my face. It was a disaster. So I'm glad I didn't do it on my wedding day, but take these things seriously especially from the professionals um, so of course we can reach out to you as a bride a bridal party or whatever if yes. we want any of your services um, this is there a season that certain procedures um, are more popular because we're in or out of the sun or things like yes. that? Yes, you know, I think it kind of depends on what you're wanting. In terms of surgical procedures, mm -hmm. definitely summertime's a busy time for me. Yes. That's a lot uh, time when a lot of people are, are off work mm -hmm. or are planning for vacations. But again, just like when planning for a wedding or planning for any big event, you really want to give yourself enough time, right? So enough time to recover from whatever procedure that is, but also time to get on the schedule for whatever it is you're wanting. So yes. I have a lot of patients that come in, I want surgery next week. Well, that's a little Honey, bit- Honey, you can't even get a nail appointment in a week. <laughs> How are they trying to get surgery? So plan ahead, contact Dr. Cassidy Hinojosa at her office, Coastal Cosmetic Plastic Surgery Center, and get scheduled today for whatever it is you're needing. And if you're interested in the Botox party, her whole vibe at her office feels like a bachelorette party. So <laughs> it's gonna be a good time. Thank you so much for joining oh, us today. You.